They, they, you know, Dancing with the Stars contacted me, and, you know, they were, the first question was, you know, do you think you could do it? And they were interested because I was missing my arm. I haven't had an arm amputee. Of course, my first thought was, I'm an above-the-knee amputee. Because everybody keeps mentioning Amy Purdy. You know, she did amazing. You know, I've watched her clips, but she's below the knee on both her legs. So there's no comparison. There is nothing we have in common. Uh, so it's, in my mind, the, when we had that first conversation on the phone, they kept talking about my arm. I wasn't even thinking about the arm. You know, it's always the leg. But then I told them I would be interested in doing it because it's nothing I've ever done. You know, and that's how I got into doing a lot of the races and marathons and mountain climbing because it's like, what can I think of that's unexpected of me to do with my injuries? One thing I'd want to say is, you know, the amount of support that has come out of Birmingham throughout everything I've done, even when I, before I did any of the, you know, True Life or Men's Health or anything, there's always been a huge support, you know, locally for whatever I was doing and trying to attempt. And this is just another thing. Like I said, I'm already getting stopped places where people are like, you know, we're proud of you. When I stepped, when I was going to the airport, when I came back from L.A. when it was announced, you know, everybody, on the, all these people on the plane were saying they saw it. And then someone in the parking lot yelled out their car, you know, we're rooting for you. And that is amazing.